How do AI and machine learning differ? It dates back to the 1950s and can be used to any program or device that imitates human intellect. This covers both straightforward applications like a virtual checkers player and complex machinery like self-driving automobiles. Some experts in the area make a distinction between broad artificial intelligence, thinking, autonomous agents, which does not yet exist and AI technologies that are now in use. Artificial intelligence is subdivided into machine learning. It was first used in the 1970s. A machine or computer that is fed and educated on existing data and subsequently is able to discover patterns distinguishes itself as machine learning. A machine or computer that is fed and trained on existing data and subsequently is able to recognize patterns, predict outcomes, or carry out tasks when presented with data it has never seen before is known as a machine learner. The act of turning data and experience into new knowledge, often in the form of a mathematical model, is what is referred to as machine learning. This model may then be applied to additional tasks after it has been built. This makes it possible to create apps that would be difficult or time-consuming to create without the aid of computers. One possibility is to train a machine learning system using millions of instances of tag tumors in MRI images. Based on these instances, the system is able to. The algorithm can identify patterns of traits that make up a tumor based on these examples. This acts as a model to assess the presence of cancers in fresh MRI scans. These machines frequently outperform human specialists. A potent technology, machine learning is being used in more and more computer applications. Its pervasiveness makes it more difficult to identify AI systems that rely on human-written and understandable rules and facts rather than data and are not trained on data. Good old-fashioned AI, or GOFAI, refers to applications that employ artificial intelligence but don't learn from data or generate novel outcomes depending on exposure to it. And some of them are still in use. For instance, a straightforward chatbot may just respond to queries using for instance, a straightforward chatbot may just respond to queries by delivering pre-written responses that include pertinent phrases. And lastly, machine learning is a subset of deep learning. Deep learning builds artificial neural networks using machine learning methods but layering the algorithms. These networks, which are based on the human brain, have proven useful in a variety of circumstances. Applications that use deep learning are more likely to give users a genuine human-like interaction experience.